Hello everyone. I Nikhil welcome you to Vigyan Bharat. In this video, I'll going to discuss today about complete outline of our first course for the session 2022 and 23. So, in this video I'm going to discuss everything about the course covering about the syllabus which we're going to cover in this course, the reference books which we're going to use at a, as a guide for us to go through in this course how many lectures will be there what will be the duration of each lecture and some good strategy for those who are preparing for some good competitive examinations so everything will be going to cover in this course so i just want to say that watch the video till the end and if you find this useful then do drop a comment in the comment section about how you find this and if you have any suggestions or queries related to the course then feel free to again drop in the comment box or either on the telegram group so without any delay let's get started let's discuss the outline of the course and all the points which we're going to cover in this video today so first we're going to discuss the syllabus part of the course what we're going to cover. Second, this is very important for us that the reference book which we're going to follow throughout the course. The third point is about the strategy what we're going to follow in order to make this course a successful one. The number of lectures and their duration and finally some prerequisites. So let's so let's uh, move ahead now. On to the first point, syllabus. So, first thing I want to make something clear about the syllabus that I have taken the syllabus part from some good competitive examinations which are conducted by jointly by the top seven Indian Institute of Technologies and Indian Institute of Science Bangalore in India. So, they are two exams are for someone who is in their bachelors and wish to pursue a master's degree in mathematics or statistics from 23 IITs in India. So these two exams, IIT JAM, Indian IIT stands for again Indian Institute of Technology. JAM is JAM means Joint Admission Test to Masters in Mathematics, whose subject code is MA. So this is the first exam. The second exam is IIT JAM Mathematical Statistics and the third which is again very important examination in perspective if someone wish to pursue a doctoral degree in mathematics in India. So this is known as CSIR conducted by jointly by CSIR and UGC University Grant Commission for national eligibility test in lecturership as well as for junior research, research fellowship GRF in mathematics. The subject code is mathematical sciences. So these three standard examinations I have just take, take, I'm taking as a reference for someone who is from India and watching uh, this course. But very important point for all our international community who are, who are joined with us that this course will not restrict only to these but will cover a broad outline covering all the topics from these entrance examinations and some more topics related to them. So let's discuss quickly the first entrance syllabus for the first exam IIT JAM Mathematics. This part I have just taken the part which comprises of reanalysis. Later on when we will be coming with our new courses then we will covering that course related syllabus. So the real analysis part of the IT jam comprise of you can just have a quick read of that sequence and series of real numbers so which is again a very elementary topic but it includes further convergence of sequences bounded and monotone sequences Cauchy sequences Bolzano Vistros theorem absolute convergence test and so on all these topics. So if you are someone who are, who has studied 
course in real analysis or wish to go wish to pursue and definitely these topics you will going to you have to go through in your syllabus part wherever you are studying the second is functions of one real variable which will include the notions of limit continuity ivt intermediate value property differentiation rose theorem mean value theorem this is a very important rule in order to tackle the indeterminate forms then taylor's theorem which is again a very important result and we want to approximate some given function by some with the help of the derivatives and taylor series maxima minima riemann integration so all these topics we're going to be covered let's move ahead so this was the syllabus for someone who is preparing for iit jam examination in mathematics so this aspect will be covered next for iit jam mathematics statistics again you can go through the same in the similar lines there will be some addition but we'll going to cover every part of syllabus okay so now just a quick glimpse glimpse of the real analysis portion on csir net mathematical science examination so again it start from elementary set theory which is a very fundamental concept which everyone should know before moving ahead with the course in analysis or in some other courses like linear algebra so here some good notions are mentioned countability and countability of sets real number system is a complete ordered field in which we discuss very important concepts of suprema infima of some sets why q lacks the completeness property and so that's all we're going to discuss covering all these topics so if you see here at the last at the very last it includes some notion from metric spaces compactness connectedness nonlinear spaces space continuous functions etc so these notions whenever uh, someone is going through a first elementary course in analysis real analysis so these uh, notions are not covered at the very early stage but as they are mentioned here so definitely they are part of these are basic part of topology course someone who is pursuing a topology so there uh, they may have seen the these they should come as a very in the very beginning of the course but we will try to cover it also okay so now let's move ahead with the reference books which will be uh, very which will lay the foundation for this course so first book which we're going to follow is a basic course in real analysis by ajit kumar professor ajit kumar and professor s kumar sen so a very beautiful and elegant book to the point written by these two professors so here is the photo of this book the second book is understanding analysis by stephen abbot by stephen abbot so this is so this book will be our second text and just some thing very important which you, sh which you should observe that for basic topology part that matrix spaces compactness connectedness when we'll proceed later in this course then i'm going to tell you the books regarding that right now focus is on the analysis part okay and uh, you can get the pdf of all these books uh, from the our telegram group whose link you can find in the description of this video let's move ahead now this is very important part of the today's video strategy of the course how we're going to cover the course first point in the first point you see it is first point comprise of two points the theory examples and problems so first we'll whenever we are beginning with the topic say real number system then we're going to cover the theory involved in that the whole theory part will be covered some good examples will be discussed along in the videos as well as some good problems will be solved so this will be covered the second point is pyqs previous year question papers pyqs that is the question which were asked in uh, the previous year examinations if someone is preparing for those examination or some other related examinations like i sai kolkata examination cmi examination so we'll try to cover the pyqs of those pyq skills from those exams for practice as well as in the homework part i will give you some assignments so you can again uh, join that group and 
from those that group you will going to get the all the content there the third point is draft description this is a very important aspect because when we are reading the theory and uh, we have to make a cross check of whether we are pro making a progress or not in the course so for that whatever the doubts you have whenever you are doing uh, some good hard work by first going through the theory understanding the theoretical part and then solving the problems which are which are which are given to you then definitely you will come across some doubts and in order to clarify those doubts and we should have some discussion and the solutions so you should again join that community of telegram which is going to help you for this aspect so all these three will going to form the our tools as a stretched strategy for this course now the number of lectures i have uh, just mentioned 25 lectures and in bracket i have, I have uh, written at least so minimum 25 lectures will be there in this course but uh, as a syllabus is a bit vast according to different examinations as well as we have to take care of all the all the topics should be covered when we are covering this course so there will be minimum of 25 lectures but it it may go long or we'll try to finish it in these particular now the duration for the course uh, i would say uh, per video it will be somewhere minimum of 20 minutes it may go till 30 minutes it depends on the topic and the video the, the content whatever the topics which is covering in the lecture okay so don't uh, worry in that part finally some prerequisites that is uh, some prior knowledge which I expect from you when you are going through this course. It, if you know this knowledge, it is going to be very helpful for you. But if you don't have, then don't worry even. We will try to cover this part also. So the prerequisite, the first one is classification of numbers. Uh, when we are beginning with this course on real analysis, I assume that you have all the basic knowledge of the our number system. That is the natural number, whole number, integer, rational, irrational. What is the relation in between... Uh, some numbers from those sets but the property they preserve where they lack so i expect this classification you should be clear and the second uh, the second uh, prerequisite you should have is the basic understanding of set theory you should know basic understanding of set theory their elementary properties what operations you can combine on two sets like union complements set difference, symmetricity, and uh, so all those related ele elementary concepts you should be familiar. These and uh, just I would like I would like to mention that for these two I have have two playlists. Uh, if you go to the playlist section, there there you find the very first video on the classification of numbers and the second elementary set theory. Set theory is covered, so you can just quickly go through each of the videos before beginning with this course. Okay, let's move ahead. And finally, uh, before concluding this video, uh, this is for the part of queries that if you have any queries, if uh, even after going through the course, you are finding something which is not covered or anything, uh, any query which you are stuck somewhere after when we try to go through the telegram group but even if you want some more assistance from our side then you can drop us an email on this email id viganbharat2020 at gmail.com and uh, we do also have a whatsapp support on this mobile number so you, whatever queries you have you can drop it there also okay so this uh, this this we have covered in the video today every point i have covered and before concluding, I would like to just uh, say that uh, two or three important points which are going to be helpful for you. Join the Telegram group, uh, find its link in the about section or or, or maybe or you can find its link in the description of this video. That group will going to be definitely very helpful for you throughout this course as well as the coming courses. Second thing is if you're new to our channel, then uh, do subscribe it and press the bell icon. Why it's the, the bell icon, why it's important because if you press it, then whenever I upload something new, some new content, then you will to get a pop-up notification either in your uh, mobile phone or whatever you're connected through. So there you will get a notification and updates at the earliest. And 
the final uh, point which i would like to mention that uh, do share about your initiative among your friends so that they can be equally benefited uh, from what we are doing this sh this should reach to some students who re really need some good guidance uh, and mentoring support uh, any kind of support what we can help them contribute them and so that's all and uh, if you have any queries then do drop uh, in the comment box or in the telegram group so whatever you find convenient so thank you so much for watching and we'll be shortly going to move ahead with this beginning with this course with beginning with this course so thanks so much for watching